Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and we are going to do a completion mark, which we haven't done in a while. But we're going to do a completion mark for Greedier Mode. And I'm thinking Mammon seems pretty interesting for Greedier Mode. I haven't really considered how this character would play out in this mode, to be honest. And yeah, I'm kind of intrigued by it. I'm not going to lie. He seems like he could be a rather swell fella, to be honest. A rather swell fella indeed. So, now my question is, if I go ahead and decide to pay for a key, will it pay for itself? <laughs> the big question, indeed. Right, so we got 10 cent. So, if I pay for a key, will it pay for itself or is it never worth buying keys as this character? Okay, it paid for itself. Okay, so it is worth it. Still don't really get why there's piggies in here, but there you go. Hey, okay, right. We'll come in here. We'll grind our meat. We'll put him there. Honestly, the items available right now don't really take my fancy, apart from maybe the arm. Um, The arm seems like it could be kind of good. But yeah, so I could pay into this guy or grab items, and I'm not sure what's best. I think to start with, I'm going to pay into this guy and see what's what. Um, we got Yen Penny. What does Yen Penny do again? I'll, I'll take a look at that in a second. I'm going to pay into him again. I'm unfortunate. John speaking of a coin to drop a mini capsule, grant a small random setup for the current floor. That could be very good, honestly. That could be very good. So we, 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 we will see. It really depends on how likely of a chance this chance is. But, if it counts for the spinning pennies, then we're on for a good un. We're on for a good un, and I'm hopeful. We'll see, we'll see. Either way, how is everybody doing on this fine, fine day? I've just had a quite a busy day at work. I mean, compared to my regular day, it was very busy. I had to go and uh, do a bunch of streaming of football games. It was, it was fun, I had a good time, but it was definitely stressful, and things definitely did not go the way I'd hoped throughout the entire thing, uh, to the point where, at one point, we were actually live streaming a football game, and one of the tech operators just unplugged the power. Just unplugged the power. I don't know if he meant to do it. I don't think he did, but it was still like, dude, <laughs> like, that power is doing everything right now. We need that power, and it's it's gone now. Can we, can we get rid of this guy that's firing balls of death at us? Thank you. He's starting to cheese me off. Also, yeah, I don't know how much use I'm going to get out of Meat Grinder, to be honest. But yeah, it seems like the Yen Penny thing, it's it's decent, but not great. It seems like you have to get quite a lot of money for it to be valuable. Um, so it's kind of a shame that we're not getting too much use out of that, but it's not awful either. Good thing is we're getting a few extra pennies here and there um, out of the kills, which is nice. Sometimes we get some of those. I don't know if really if luck affects that or whatnot, but... We're seeing some extra here and there. As for the question of the day today, what are you currently stressed about? What's 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 your stressor today? I'm gonna I'm gonna keep playing into this guy and hope for the best. There you go. Pretty 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 good. Um, swing an arm in the direction you're firing. The arm can parry any projectiles and will uh, and with tight timing boost your own tears. Reflective projectiles and tears explode on contact. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna buy that and try it out. Oh, the shattered dice would have been good though. The shattered dice would have been good, though. Our guy is looking rather gnarly. Okay, with very tight timing. Yeah, there you go. You can you can fire. You've you've got to do it at exactly the right time for it to work. But the rubber bullets, though, very good stuff. We like that. I really like that too. Okay. Rubber bullets is just increased damage that we're dealing to enemies. We like that a lot. And we can knock back projectiles if we time it right. Gotta time it exactly right though, so it's not always gonna happen. Oh, can you not spawn minions, please? I'd rather you didn't, my good guy. I'd rather you didn't. Hey, there you go. Yeah, but I got an arm's pretty good. Retribution causing us some errors, apparently. No, that penny disappeared way too quickly. What the hell? <clears throat> right, let's go for this. Don't know who we're reflecting too many from you. 
But goddamn, Rubber Bullets is absolutely killing it. Honestly, Rubber Bullets does some crazy shit sometimes. You see how much damage that did then? Awesome bit of extra money there. Devil Deal is obviously not for us right now. Item pedestals reroll when you touch the... Yeah, unfortunately that's an active, so not ideal. Um, I think I'm going to pop that. I'll buy this just to save my myself some HP. And I'll play you a little bit as well and see what we get. Permanent speed up, not bad. I think I have to... I know I just bought the arm, but Sprinkler's pretty goddamn good. Sprinkler's pretty goddamn good for uh, Greedy Emerd. Even if the arm is a little bit more fun. Ooh, we got a magic mush in the shop, baby. Okay, that's priority number one for buying. If I do say so myself. We should be able to buy it straight off the bat here, actually. We could just get rid of these goddamn pigs. Oh, man, there's a... There's a sketch from um, from American... I said sketch. There's a, a bit from American Dad that anyone that's watched it will know what I'm about to say. Um, <laughs> where <laughs> the, the, the whole premise of the episode, or, or at least one of the plot lines of the episode, is that Steve and his friends are uh, slow roasting. They've like, they've, they've like got a crock pot and they're like slow roasting a, uh, like pork. Um, and they, they slow, basically this guy like comes up to me in a trench coat and like opens his trench coat like he's gonna be selling like fake watches or something and he's just got like a crock pot in there and he keeps telling them the slower the roast the better the taste and so he gets like he, he kind of goes like way crazy on it and ends up like slow roasting this meat for like I think he ends up slow roasting it for like two weeks or something or crazy or like three weeks and then they eat it and obviously as, as expected they get like severely ill from eating gone off meat uh like with maggots and stuff in it and it like it like makes him really ill and the ambulance comes and like he's clearly going a bit crazy because <laughs> the guy in the ambulance is like the emt is like why on earth would you eat two week old pork um <laughs> and he's like that guy told me to and points to uh the guy that with a trench coat across the road and then the guy in the trench coat like takes off a mask and um, he, it's just two pigs stacked on top of each other in a trench coat. And he just starts screaming, it's pigs, it's pigs. And then the fucking EMT pulls off a mask as well. <laughs> um, and he's also a pig. And he just, go, he just goes, this isn't an ambulance. It's a goddamn ambulance. And it's just a fuck. The, the ambulance is literally like a pig can. Oh my God. It sounds really fucking stupid the way I'm describing it. But trust me, go on YouTube and just type in, like, American Dad, it's pigs, and you will see the hilarity of which I am discussing. I'll put him down there. I think it's, I don't know, it's just, it's so stupid, but I find it absolutely hilarious. Don't you touch my little friend. Beautiful stuff. Right. Item-wise, nah, but we'll keep going here first. Probably shouldn't have done that in an extra one, but... It'll speed things up a little bit, so why not? It will speed things up a little bit, so why not? Oh god, I forgot it's four dashes on these guys. How are you not more bruised, good guy? How are you not more bruised? Angel deal? Angel deal, baby. In here, ooh, okay, okay, okay. My bad. My bad. Do I... Do I... Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah, good. Okay, in the future, remember to do Angel Deal when I've got low money, not high money. Um, and then I think with this, we'll, we'll just pay into this guy and hope he pays out. Hope he pays out. Hope he pays out. Damn you. That's pretty good, though. I think we'll take that. That's pretty good. Right. Let's go. Oh, man. Yeah, there's some things in American Dad. I absolutely love American Dad. Some people are like, th still think it's like, just like Family Guy. It's it's not. It's so good. To be fair, though, to be fair, the TED TV show recently was very, very surprising. It's, it's, quite good 
I was not expecting it to be good at all, really. But it's it's very, very decent. Okay, our shop is a bit of a bust here. Shop is a bit of a bust. Right. Let's go ahead. Have these skulls do some work for us as well. Oh, we've got some turning into gold action. We've got some freezing action. We've got some good stuff going on here. Oh, he's mini. He's mini. Didn't mean to pay into that guy immediately, but uh, he seemed to give something. Chance to take a random pill when picking up a penny was that. That could be very interesting, but very dangerous. What is it? Chance to take a random pill and pick up a coin. Oh, that seems awful, but I'll take it because it's interesting. All right, let's put that down. I didn't check out my shop. Oh, one minute. I've got a really itchy arm. Not armpit. What's the what's the crease between your elbow? Like, other side of your elbow. Is that an arm? What, what the hell is that called? Elbow pit? It's still technically an armpit, right? Not the armpit, but it's... I got a health down, so... So far, so good. So far, we're quite impressed with the way this has been working for us. Obviously. And then it's just no other pills at all so far. Oh, really? You ducked away before the holy lights got you? That would have been nice. Well, this is going to be a bit fucked, isn't it? Oh, really? I might die here. There's a chance I die here. There's a lot going on right now. Dude! With the, the, with the floor spikes and everything? Oh my lord. How is how is Big Boy here got so much health still? I managed to scoop in there and grab that. Ill advised, I've realized, but I wanted it. Okay, we we're, we're done. I gotta fucking tell. Guess we'll be restarting then. That was evil. That was pure evil. A health down and a teleport. Ooh, loaded dice would be chunky. Would be chunky. Ooh, petrified poop. Not bad here. Loaded dice could be a, a rather intriguing. Get out of the way, pig. Purple fire hit me as well. Bullshit. Right. Right now, loaded dice is pretty useless, but it could end up being good. Plop you down there for now. Ah, uh, right. Okay. That was a unnecessary and rather annoying death, I have to say. Both very unnecessary and very, very annoying. Not how I expected to die, I must tell you. Also, this geezer needs to go. Getting annoyed with him. Luckily, we're getting a lot of extra pennies, which is really nice. Unfortunately, if we get any here, they'll be pretty hard to grab. Oh, you better fuck off. Unless your little minions can spawn extra pennies, then, then I don't mind you too much. But I have a feeling they can't. Right. We've got a good amount of extra money so far, so this might be a better start, potentially. 
Yeah, I've got to... I've got to make some decisions here, and I think you all know what my decision's going to be. Okay, that was not what we planned for. There's also another penny out there that I didn't see as well, apparently. You guys just want to create the largest ash pieces ever. Okay, so, I think you all know where this is going to go, and it's an odd place, but I think we're going to take Corn Kernel. Right. I'm not super enthused about my chances of survival here, which is something that I, I'm going to be kind of annoyed at, because this run is potentially pretty interesting. My chances of survival are not looking too hot. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, man. This is too much already. The jumping ones are uh, not too easy to predict. I'm kind of hoping that the other boss just stays in his line and fucks off out the way for a while here, because so far that's what he's doing. Okay. There's a spinny coin there that I couldn't get, but it is what it is. Right, you need to chill out, my guy. How have I done, like, no damage to him so far? This game's bullshit sometimes. Let me, let me have a chance, please. A chance to dream. I mean, you are spawning coins for me, which I wasn't expecting spawns would be able to do. Dude, this is unreal. You need to chill. I could just farm these guys forever in the hopes of getting a bunch of coins, but I feel like that's a, a rather boring way to play this whole shenanigans here. Oh my god, he's relentless. Just stop for once in your life. Just chill out. It's an onslaught. It's an absolute onslaught. Okay, finally, dude. I need that so badly. Okay, I got it. Oh my god. Right. Level two, baby. Right, I'll also be buying that, thank you. And I might as well buy a key. I don't, know, I don't need to buy a key, though, do I? I don't need to buy a key. Right. Level two, all but the shoots weak explosives, familiar teleports and chase enemies. Okay. This is going to be a rough, a rough fight as well, to be honest. Um, don't think that's a good idea, really. Interesting to note that each segment might be able to drop a coin, though. There is a small chance of us getting an additional item out of this. Small chance being the optimum word there. Just got to be very, very aware of where the other pieces to this puzzle are. Okay, luckily I managed to kill one of them fully before taking on the next one, which helps. So maybe it's just the first segment that can drop money, because that happened both times. Which I don't think is a coincidence. It would have been one penny off another one if I hadn't bought that heart, but there's no way I'm not buying that heart. Okay. 
I think we're good to go to the next floor. That was horrible. Really? That doesn't blow up that? That's annoying. Okay, um, we good to go? I'm just going to quickly check one other thing here. Make sure it doesn't blow up these guys. Yeah, it doesn't. Damn it. It's annoying. To the next floor. Okay. Right. Well, that's rather nice. I mean, I can just... I don't have to kill the pigs, do I? Okay. Restocks the current shop will also restock devil deals and stairway shops. Damn, that's a pretty good item. Pretty good too. I think that's a Yera. I think it's worth buying a bomb. We don't have bombs. Good. Good. Okay then. Right. <clears throat> Onwards. On to victory. Are you a champion? Yes, you are. Great. You're a really annoying champion as well. Why are we going to get a champion that's a really annoying champion right off the bat? There you go. Mini explosives from this guy. Doing some good work. I'd like to take out that guy that's spawning stuff soonish. Okay, that, that penny's probably gone. Oh, for fuck's sake. What, wait, what did I even take damage on them? What heart? Did I have a soul heart? I didn't think I had soul hearts. Dude! That's the second time that bitch has done that to me. Stop telefragging me. So I think we're dead again. This is, this is awful. There's this invisible guy that's definitely going to end up running into me and ruining my life. It's this dude that needs to die. Why is my little explosive corn nugget thing not doing anything? Also, how are you still spawning stuff, my guy? How are you not dead yet? Oh my god, this is torture. <laughs> okay, you're dead, finally. I do not like all these fucking rain clouds either. God, this is so tricky. I liked it when we had Sprinkler. Also, my corn boy, I, I just wish he was better. Okay. Come back in here. Pop this. Buy one. Buy two. Buy this. You better be good. Little corn boy, you better be good. Why did I buy the heart when those hearts back there? Do not ask me for I do not have answers to these questions. My little corn fella, I am heavily, heavily relying on you being very, very good. Which I, I mean, seemingly so far, you're pretty good. Seemingly so far, you're pretty good. My god. Then we'll go and buy another one of those. Thank you. And we'll see how this goes. I really, really like some HP at some point though, but at the minute we're not really getting that. 
Okay, now I can kind of just hit, like, stay out of the way, which is kind of nice. Monstro, you're dead. Now on to you. That hit me. Fuck you. Dude, my corn nugget guy just absolutely fucking earned me. Right. Kill him. There you go. If you shoot at me now, I'll be so annoyed. In here we go. Half my dollars. Half my dollars. Both good. Both good. Damage is now pretty decent. To the next floor. Okay. Not particularly enthused about my HP and ability to survive here. Otherwise, this is not bad. Twenty-five percent chance of zero damage when getting hit. Ooh, baby, that's nice. That is rather sweet, I have to say. Right. I probably will take Voodoo Pin, to be honest. Once I can, that is. I've not really used my Meat Grinder at all here, but, I mean, come on now. Who wouldn't do this? I don't know, the Voodoo Pin sounds good, but another Corn Boy. Another Corn Boy does sound somewhat better. Really? You're going to just release another enemy onto us? Okay. Luckily, we've got good damage ourselves as well, so we're able to do some stuff for ourselves here and not just rely on Corn Boy. <clears throat> Hopefully, as long as we pick up some pennies here from enemies we murder, we should be able to afford a few extras here and there. Alright, release all of these and yeah, he'll just annihilate them like he does. Oh, we missed out on quite a few pennies there, I didn't realise. Nice. Voodoo pin, do I want you? I do, but... Ah! Uh. Hmm. I kind of didn't think about this. Old be Getting multiple old bells is not a bad idea. I wonder if that, sta if that stacks 25%, maybe at 50, it would be very good. I didn't consider the fact that I have other items now, though. Okay, this this one makes you larger thing is making him some extreme speed teleporty boy. Super speedy teleporty boy, can you get on that? Oh god, there's some creep on the floor that I did not see. I was not aware of. I won't say I didn't see, because I did. Can you fucking chill out, my guy? Holy shit. Oh, it's because he's stuck on my fucking Bernie boy here. Right, I need this guy to die. Where did I even get this Bernie boy from? Oh, dude, I just got hit by my fucking corn. So, th this this dude is currently ruining everything we have going for us. What, why why did developers not account for this bullshit? Annoying as hell. Kill him! Kill him! Oh my lord, my Bernie boy still lives. Why? 
Fucking stop shooting me, you prick. Fucking stop shooting me! Oh my god, he, this, this dude's just ruining everything. Ruining everything. I can't fucking escape this. This is... Genuinely awful. I need this guy to die. Otherwise, I am quite fucked. Oh, finally, he's dead. Right, fucking get out of here, you shithead. Do your job. That's a devil deal, game. That's a devil deal. Uh, That's not how I thought that would work. That's annoying. I thought it'd just give me it. Well, anyhow. A waste of money there. Ugh, man. This has been annoying. Don't you dare explode me. Alright, what items we got available to us? Straw man. Right, we charge her up. Let me get her going. Oh my god. I'm gonna stop it here. I know that's like not what we normally do, but I think it will help a lot. It's taking a while to kill stuff, corn boy. He's taking a while to kill stuff. Good. Small corn boy. I don't know what the small corn boy does, to be honest. It seems like not a fucking lot. Yeah, the small one's terrible. What is he what is he doing? He's just like teleporting around randomly and doing almost nothing most of the time. Also, this 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 room is rather disgusting. How did I not get hit there? The fuck is this? Ha How is anyone meant to survive this bullshit? Without getting hit. Thank you, Blackheart, honestly. That was gross. What's this bouncy thing still around for? Right. Give me that. Right, we've got two corn boys now doing bits. They're professionals. So we should be able to do a good job here. Oh, there's uh, herming shots there. These are, these waves are gross, man. Who the fuck made these? I thought this was okay. God damn. Wait, I might die here because this is just like ridiculous amounts of herming enemies.
These corn boys are not not as good as as you'd think. Not as good as you'd think. Where's the health? Wait, I'm one penny off? God damn it. Any way I can get one penny. Really one penny off? Don't do me dirty like this game. I need that HP. Oh, dude, these waves are just horrible. I never ever want to play greed mode ever again. Who would do who would do this to a human? Like my corn boys don't aren't even able to do anything right now. They're literally do taking no dam uh, de dealing no damage. Oh, the fucking piss kidney. Fuck off. This is horrible. This is just horrid. Fuck off with your piss kidney. I heard a dime, but I know I'm not going to be able to get it. Yeah, it's gone. The, the fuck is this thing? Why, why is it circling at the speed of fucking light? Fucking die. Whoever you are, wherever you're from, fuck you. That... I like people that make mods, but sometimes they do stuff like that, and it makes me question if they've ever played this game in their life. Ugh, man. That was really frustrating. Anyways. Anyways. I'm tired. I'm not playing the best. I hope you guys enjoyed my incoherent ramblings and complaining, and I'll see you guys in the next one.